Oh, hi. Um, guess what we're doing? Onan Streak again. It's your favorite. Oh, boy. Let's uh, see if we can't do it this time. I got relatively high hopes for someone who hasn't played any Isaac today. I'm gonna go ahead and <laughs> do one of those real quick. Um, not high enough hopes to to get detonator on our first room and then uh, and then play on. I'll say that much. I have the pressure of episode 100 behind me now, not in front of me as it has been for the last few days. I also. Uh, I'm not playing like having just woken up or just about to go to sleep. And... That's about it. That's the list of, of reasons that, um... I have high hopes today. So hopefully that's gonna be enough, because I haven't got a lot more to offer. I haven't eaten recently as well, which is usually, I think, a pretty big influencer in terms of whether or not... Okay. Um, whether or not we are able to deliver. Hold on, right before I- well, right before Isaac would collide with an enemy or projectile, Dumpy farts to deflect them away. After farting, you need to get close to Dumpy to regain him. I just- I want something with a little boar- a little boar oomph, a little- a, a little boar oomph. A little more oomph, ideally. Um, how are you doing? I'm okay. I, um... It's, what is it today? Today is Monday, and uh, I would say maybe the only day of the week where you, like, really have to think about what day it is. Ow. Okay. <laughs> it's the only day of the week where you really have to think about it, because you're, I mean, you're tired, usually, as an adult, you're pretty tired on a Monday. So you're not super with it, and then every other day of the week enters, uh, a phenomenon that I haven't, ooh, a phenomenon that I haven't come up with a name for yet, that I think lots of other people are already well aware of, but, you know, maybe some folks haven't, um, had the opportunity, ow, to properly discuss or indulge yet, but it's the, uh, it is the idea that each day of the week, is sort of ca characterized or punctuated by its relevance to a different day of the week. So, you know, Sundays are a drag because you're like, oh my god, tomorrow's Monday, that sucks. Then, you have uh, Tuesdays, or, or you have Mondays, which are like, you know, it's the start of the week, you you don't think about Tuesday on uh, ow. You don't think about Tuesday on Monday because you're just so bummed about the fact that it's Monday. Um, so Monday is just Monday, which is why it's the worst day. Sunday... Uh, we, we've done Sunday, sorry, not Sunday. Tuesday... You'll... Ow. Okay. Okay. You know what? <laughs> if I'm gonna be playing like that... Listen, I said that I had high hopes. What I didn't account for was the fact that I wouldn't play what that I wouldn't play well today. So, I mean, now that I'm aware that that's on the on the cards, I'm very nervous about going back into that room. Um, Tuesday, you're like, "Oh, thank God it's not Monday anymore." Then Wednesday, you're like, holy crap, I'm halfway through the week already. Thursday, you're like, oh my god, tomorrow is... F uh, this is no good. You're like, oh my god, tomorrow's Friday. And then Friday, you're like, it's here. Ow. You're like, it's here, it's the big one. Friday, baby. And then, uh, and then Saturday, you're like, huge, it's Saturday. Um, there's no forgetting that one. Um, right, um, hold on, let's just try and get like a good, let's just try and get something going here. 
Let's just see if we can't get something going here, and then I'll carry on with this whole weekday thing. Um, sorry, I just, I'm a little, you know, clearly trying to monologue at the top of the ep- Okay. <laughs> um, you know what, let's just, let's fish something out here. Let's just see what we can find. That's what I'm talking about. Just a good old stats up? That's the kind of thing we're looking for. Okay, well this is not ideal. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Easy, easy, easy. I'm very nervous. Okay. Um, now, we're off to a roaring start. So, <laughs> as, as I explained previously, I'm sure you'll remember, all of the days, save for Monday and Saturday, pertain to, or, or the mindset of that day is, it pertains to just thinking about a different day. You just, you, all you do is you think about what day is coming up next, or what day has just been. Um, whether it's good or bad. For the most part, they're good. The only bad one is Sunday. So when I said that Monday was the worst day, I was lying. Or at least I wasn't thinking straight. Because the worst day is Sunday. And it's the worst day because it's the only one with where you actively worry about the next day. It's the only one where you're like, oh god, tomorrow is X day. Because all of the others are like, oh hell yeah, tomorrow is X day. Even Saturday, you're like, hell yeah, tomorrow's Sunday. I thought that like maybe the weekend was nearly over. Turns out I still have like 50% of it to go. Every enemy in the room gets charged, uh, charmed, I guess. I guess so. It's not like another rule stats up, but I guess maybe I'm asking for a little much at that point. I, uh, I do find that Monday is the only day that I regularly forget, though. Like, the Monday comes around, and I, I think maybe because I'm trying not to think about it, but I do anyway, because you have to, because stuff comes up in life. You're like, oh, what have I got to do today? What day is it today? More often than not, like, every other day, I'm like, how could I forget? It's, it's X day. Are you what are you kidding me? It's it's Wednesday. You know what that means? It's the day that I go and do some grocery shopping. Mm -mm -mm, can't wait. Monday is just like a a burner day. Like non-stop. I don't think I've ever done anything on a Monday. Hold on. There we go. Surgical. That was beautiful. Look at this. I'll take four soul hearts, for sure. And that's gonna carry me through to the angel room quite nicely, I imagine. We could possibly check a curse room in a little bit. We won't be doing so anytime soon. I'll tell you that much. Um... But yeah, that, I mean, so that's that said, there isn't much more to say about it. That's just kind of the layout of how, like, you know, how the weekdays work and how, like, it's very easy to, and I mean, this isn't like a rule for life. This isn't how everyone thinks. I had to learn to think this way. And it's, this is part of being like an adult with a, a nine to five job is conditioning your brain to... Uh, be Komodo hype about the work week. So that when you wake up, you're not like, Oh god, I'm here, I'm still here. <laughs> Instead, you wake up and you're like, Yo, it's almost, it's, it's already Tuesday, which means it's almost Wednesday, which means it's nearly Thursday, which means Friday's right around the corner. And you know what happens when Friday comes around? It means tomorrow's Saturday. Let's go. <laughs> oh... Uh, okay, we only missed the one. I thought maybe I was about to miss two back to back. Back to back to back to back to back till I stop rapping. Ooh, I'm gonna carry you around for sure. Let's do the aim. Let's try and get our angel deal first, actually. Hold on. We only had the one bomb, I've discovered. 
I'm pretty nervous all of a sudden. Oh wait, never mind, I'm sick of the game. Oh my god, we got the angel deal. Ah, oh, they're terrible. <laughs> oh no. Okay, well I'm gonna dice shot. Oh. <laughs> um. You know what? You know what? I think we've done this bit before, but I think this is gonna help us. Drops half a heart every three rooms. That could be pretty nice, maybe. You never know. There's a, a sacrifice room that we could play. I don't really know why we would. I'm wondering if leaving the Soul of Eden was a good idea. In my head, it was because we value the Book of Belial quite highly. However, maybe it was a mistake to uh, leave it behind. We'll take the tower just like in case, I guess. I am not fully relaxed. I am somewhat relaxed. But there is much more relaxation to be gleaned. Um, especially because it's Monday. <laughs> okay, hold on a sec. There we go. Uh-oh. Beautiful. Let's check what's in here. I love this. Um, I'm going to hope for a key. I received no keys. We did get three items, though, which is pretty poggers. Displays he helpful tips on use. Excellent. Thank you. Um... I've never had the rules card before. I'm quite glad that I've never had the rules card before. I'm disappointed to have gotten it now. Okay, that got a little close. A little closer than I would have liked. The Spear of Destiny is working for us right now. Which I'm pretty happy about. We could try and open that chest. Feels like it might be a little silly. There we go. Let's go back to our treasure room. Um, do I have anything else to add about the weekdays thing? No, not really. Like... Oh. I mean, almond milk is a definite no. This is 100% this is the way to go. I If we could re-roll that at some point, that would be amazing, but I doubt it's going to happen. This is definitely not a run we want almond milk on. Um... The, I mean, best day, probably, what have I said in the past? I think best day I've said was Friday, which is a bit of a no-brainer. No Thursday is shockingly quite high up there. Because Thursday is like, Thursday somehow becomes a bit of like a nice write-off because Friday is coming. So everyone's like kind of getting ready for Friday a little bit. I don't know how true that actually is, or if that's just me. Whoops. I mean, so far this run's going better than our previous. Whether or not that's going to hold out is a, a matter of its own. Sorry, I'm, I'm a burping machine over here. Um... No, it can't be th It has to be Friday no-brainer, right? Like, how is it going to be any other day? Like, the like, genuine question, how is it going to be any other day? If you have an answer that isn't Friday and you can justify it, please, uh, write into the P.O. box. Ow. I'd love to, love to hear your takes on this. Ow. Ow. Okay. Yara, duplicate will picks up pick, picks up du duplicate will pick ups in the room. Save that for a rainy day. You never know when a Yara might come in handy. I will say that we are now, thanks to the Spear of Destiny, starting to lose some of our HP, and as such, a little bit of our momentum, 
I do keep walking too close to the enemies. Is This is something I'm noticing. You might not necessarily be noticing it, because you're not a seasoned Isaac player like I am. But I... I see these things. Okay. I would like to be taking less damage. Maybe I shouldn't be quite so liberal with the use of the, uh... Of the Spear of Destiny. It seemed like a good idea. We can take two items. This is kind of good. Come at me, I dare you. I honestly dare you. Yeah, that's what I thought. We need the Yara. Where's my Yara? Hold on, we'll drop the Empress card. Oh my god. Drop the Empress card. And then we'll go back. Grab the Yara. And then we'll also duplicate the, the Empress card. Oh my god. He's learning. He's learning from his previous mistakes. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see here. I don't have a lot more going on, I'll be honest with you. I feel like I had some stuff and it's it's left my head. I don't really remember what it was. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Easy pod. Oh, I missed. Oh, fuck. I'm just gonna tank it. <laughs> I'm just gonna face tank the boss. Um, okay, that's a good... Trinket. That's a really good card. I don't think we're gonna get to duplicate it, so we're just gonna go ahead and use it. We're gonna take the Empress. And ignore the Devil Deal, because... It sounds kind of scary. Now. Where were we? I don't have anything else to talk about. I'm, I'm like all dried up over here. Literally as well, actually, because my throat is getting kind of dry. It's tough, man. I'm like, I've been talking about how I plan to go on holiday at some point. This is an excellent question. This is a phenomenal question. I'm gonna do it for science. I beg your pardon? I didn't take any damage. Oh, because it hit the fire. But if it didn't hit the fire we'd have some problems. So I may have caused myself some trouble here. We'll see. This might be bad. <laughs> um, only time will truly tell. I kind of forgot that it does still operate with range. And that it just orbits you until it runs out of range. That's This could be bad. Hold on, let me run over here. And then we're gonna go into the shop. We're gonna leave the shop, we're gonna ignore you. Um, hmm, 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 hmm. Tiny Planet was a mistake. I understand that now, and I'm ready to grow from this experience. I don't think we should dwell on it. I think we should take the good with the bad. And recognize how much growth we could get out of this. Suck on that. Ow. Okay. That was honestly not the worst mum fight we've done. I have again forgotten to bring the Fool card. We could take a, a little look. You never know. Maito would be kind of nice, but unfortunately not nice enough for me to do boss rush. I'm going to drink some water while the transition's happening. <clears throat> Sorry about that. 
My throat is all goofed up. Oh, come on. Uh oh. Okay. Tiny Planet was sincerely an error. Th of this, I am now incredibly, incredibly painfully aware. We are now qu pretty heavily reliant on our. Um, on our Spear of Destiny, which puts us in a lot of danger. Yeah, this is not good. We also haven't gotten very many HP ups, have we? That's kind of sad. I mean, what? How was that damage? We hit him. Ow! Okay, so we're not getting any angel deals to kind of save us here. We are super dead. This is like a definite reroll scenario. Um, I don't really see how we get a win out of this. Yeah, no. Hmm. Let me just do this. <laughs> I really don't see how we get a win out of that. Enemies on fire. Uh, it feels like a bad idea, but okay. Listen, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm sending it this time. And by sending it, I mean like, you know, I'm not getting tilted 15 minutes into the episode. We're 22 minutes in, and I'm giving you another chance. I'm giving you another run here. Okay, well, this is not gonna work. Hold on, I gotta pause while I clear my throat. One sec. I don't know if that helped. But, you know, we can hope. I'm not clearing this room. Nope. Hello? Nope. Hello? Nope. Wait, that might have been pretty good, actually. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I can't get mad about the wafer on a run where, like, the whole thing is that you just take lots of damage. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Um, okay, well, we got to come up with some more stuff to talk about. Unfortunately, now that we have a new run go... Okay. <laughs> oh, I, I will be real with you. I really despise this challenge. I hate this one. Plus one eternal heart. We do have to lose our Book of Belial, though. I think it might be worth it. That said, we take we take damage if we miss a shot, and then we'd lose the Eternal Heart. We'll see. Let's just see how we get on for the first floor. Like, it's basically a 1, a one HP up if we make it through this floor, which is not a problem, really. It's kind of good. It is a... It's potentially more than that as well if we really play our butts off. Let's see what's in this big room. Losing the Book of Belial does hurt, though. Like, I'm not gonna act like it doesn't. God, there goes the Eternal Heart. Okay, we're out of here. We're out of here. We're out of here. We check this. Bird's eye. Bird's eye, I could kind of get into. As a means of just doing fat damage. Some juicy, juicy damage. Considering that we're not shooting that often, it shouldn't be a big problem. It shouldn't. It may well be. I'm trying to justify taking an item that I genuinely really like in this run. Okay. 
<laughs> we have been given a second chance here with the uh, with the eternal hearts. One flame does a lot for us here. Or none flames. One flame, there it is. The one flame to rule them all. Or one flame to kill them all in this case. We just need three more rooms. We have two more right here. Oh no. Okay. This is fine. You gonna enter a little bit of a pant? No! Why would you do that to me? You've made me look a fool. I can't believe you. Okay. I can't believe you would just suddenly change directions like that. Um. Okay, well, I mean, we may as well take it into the boss room to get an Eternal Heart to take to the next floor, and then it, it is just like a 1 HP up. Okay. So we get a blue heart, so we can use you, take you, grab you, go back... Get our Book of Belial from this treasure room back here. And with that, we can kill the boss, hopefully maintain this Eternal Heart, go down to the next floor, get one HP up, and that will give us at least a mild improvement to the run. I feel like there's a lot more that I could wish for out. Whoa, come on! A lot more that I could wish for, but I don't think I'm going to get. We very nearly lost the Eternal Heart a second time. I might actually have gone postal if that had happened. We got another blue heart. And we can go down. I At, at 30 minutes in, I am beginning to approach tilt. I can, sm I can feel it encroaching in my psyche. I'm, I'm, I'm not enjoying it. I would like for this challenge to not be one that I have to do anymore. Um, okay. You guys can't go anywhere, which I like. Maybe my issue is that I charge up my shots too much? Maybe? Who's to say? Oh, come on. Bird's Eye doing me a little bit dirty there. Hold on. Okay. Burning bombs. You can no longer take fire damage. Bombs deal contact damage. Plus five bombs. That's fine, I guess. We have a little bit of a theme. Okay, this is just too many guys from too many angles. That's what she said. Devil? Sure. And I guess I'll just go this way. Ow. We will not be getting any angel deals. I'm beginning to notice. This is maybe going to be another burner. I, it was a burner. I just walked right into him. I'm going again. Put me back in. Serpent's Kiss? Absolutely not. I will not be dealing with any more of these items that uh, deal in enemies dying when I'm not ready for them to die. I just need another SMB super fan is what I need. I can't believe I got SMB Superfan and then died with it. How lame is that? A potential blue heart later. Uh, some enemies in very sticky situations. Uh... 
Okay. Forget about the coin. Ah, oh, I didn't want to take that. He's tilting. He's tilting. He's tilting. He's tilting. He's getting tilted. Tilt adjacent. I'm fine. I'm fine. There's a lot of heart that I could have taken to preserve the entire blue heart from earlier. And another. I will not be taking Polydactyl. I understand the benefits of it. But I need something juicier. I need stats. I need raw stat items. Or items that will allow me to kill without shooting. Or endangering myself. I realize that I probably should have taken... Um... I probably should have taken the... There was the Taurus item. Or Taurus or Ares or... One of those items that lets you charge. And that might actually have been pretty good. However, I was too uh, headstrong to actually take the item. I just went bolting through the room. I'm gonna wig out what's in here. It's the treasure room. I just want one more, like, starter, you know? Like a run that gets going. That's all I'm hungry for. Ow. It's, it's too brutal. I'm not good enough at the game. <laughs> oh, come on. I need, I need, I need another way to kill things. I need a, a way to kill things that is not via the use of my tears, nor a spear of destiny. I need like a little familiar or something, like a little guy that I can just send in. Hmm. No, it's not gonna be enough. It's not gonna be enough. It's nice to think about, but it's never gonna work. It's weird. We're gonna rely on it too much and it's not gonna do what we need it to do. That's not gonna do it. Rotten Baby, however, is very good. And I see a lot of good things in the future of this run. I still get flies even though I don't fire. Remember when I was talking about a little guy who's just gonna kill everyone without me having to shoot? Well, well, well. It would appear that I found my little guy. And with Rotten Baby, I shall make my fortune. Oh my god, this is perfect. I didn't even consider. I did not even consider. This is incredible. I couldn't be happier. Get him. Yes, 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 yes. Get his ass. Get him, Rotten Baby. Look at the damage the Rotten Baby does. That's not an HP up. I need HP ups. That's fine. Rotten Baby is going to hard carry us through the first who knows how... Oh, God! The first who knows how many parts of this run. I can't wait for it. You need to go. Okay. We can go to our treasure room now. I'm still nervous, because apparently I can still take damage. No, thank you. I don't like it. Maybe if I had a backpack, but I don't have a backpack. I got two skeleton keys. How about them apples? I don't care. I do not care for it. I do not want it. I do not wish to have it. I will now be going down. Very good. Very good. 
I'm growing a little bit nervous about the potential for Rotten Baby to snipe someone that I'm shooting at with his little flies. But I'm going to remain calm. Because I feel like worrying about that is exactly how I'm going to make it happen. We're going to blow this up. Get a blue heart, which I love, and a key, which I also love. There is another blue heart in the room. Your familiar is dealing double damage. Or we could do... Oh, we could have duplicated Rotten Baby. There is no slot machine in here. I haven't seen a dono machine in a... Oh, it's because it's a challenge. That's why. I was trying to figure out why I hadn't seen a dono machine in so long. It's because I'm doing challenges. That was kind of kind of beautiful. We have a lot of blue hearts coming in now. This is it. This is what we're after. And we're never going to get the double familiars, so we're just going to go down. It's nice to think about, though. Thinking about, like, getting double rotten baby every however many rooms. Get him, rotten baby. Oh my god, I didn't take any damage. Incredible. The confidence that has been instilled into me via rotten baby is... it's... it's... It's leveled up my gameplay. Level up your gameplay! Anyone else absolutely hate stuff like that? Like, I don't really understand why I hate it so much. I think maybe do because I do hate, like, gamers so much. I think gamers as, like, a hobbyist group are terrible, terrible people. But, um... Like, gamers, like, when people try to placate gamers with gamer speak, it is just horrid. I don't like it. It makes me uneasy. I'm gonna ignore all of this. It just, it makes me think about, like... I don't know, it makes me think about adults being weird and out of touch, and kids being annoying and noisy. Which is... Interesting, because, like, I don't generally think that kids are annoying and noisy. I like kids a lot, and I think they're very cool and funny. Let's just kind of squeeze in here a little. There we go. And I'm going to ignore the chest that's back there. We're going to go down. I don't think there was anything I super cared about in here. Not really. Wait, did he have coins in his eyes? He did have coins in his eyes. I don't know if this is actually reliable. It was this time. <laughs> Level up your gameplay. I've grown... I've got a bit of a sense now for, like, gamer stuff that I think will and won't succeed. Like, I was talking to somebody recently, and they were like, Oh yeah, there's this new, like, gamer-centric social media network coming about check it out and I went and looked at it and it just it had all the telling all the telltale signs of like a failing like a fail a, a to fail gamer business venture where like all the font had like loads of triangles in it you know like OG discord discord somehow slipped through the cracks but uh you know, in the way that, like, gamer font is always very angular. Because, you know, you know us gamers, we hate round shit. Ow. We hate, like, fucking... We hate, like, pillows and stuff like that. Ugh, get that out of here. Gamers hate round circles. Ugh, the sun? The mo True, actually, it's a good point I've made right there. What do gamers hate more than anything? The sun? What shape is the sun? Round? Ugh. Get that out of here. I kind of want that. Could you maybe give me a coin? No coin, huh? I would like one, though. Just one coin. They always... I don't know why they just love the angles so much. They love all the triangles and shit. They go crazy for it, these gamers. Hey, why is my fly not going for them? There we go. That's the one coin we needed for our choosable boss items. Let's roll out. This is huge. This could change the change the pace of the entire run. Grab that. Let's go. Um 
And I mean, if that wasn't enough, it had like NFTs built in or something. There was some, I couldn't, I never understand what anyone's talking about when they say that like their platform has NFTs involved. I first of all don't know why you'd want to do that, why you think that's a good idea. I think every business that announces NFT implementation gets like immediately sh like cancelled and review bombed. These days, you can't implement NFTs into anything without getting cancelled by the st oh shit, by the Steam review mob, by the mixed review mob. Oh, come on now. I'm just gonna leave it up to Rotten Baby. I'm gonna stop <laughs> making a fool of myself. Thank you, Rotten Baby. Okay, this this one's all you, Rotten Baby. <laughs> I want nothing to do with it. There are too many variables. Look at him go. He is going off right now. <laughs> He's going crazy. He saw those round Teratoma guys and he was like, get them out of here. Circles, I hate them. No circles for the gamer. Let's bomb this. And then we'll bomb this. Get him, boys. Beautiful. Beautiful angel kill. And these are both just HP ups, so we're just going to take an HP up and go down. I'll say it, this one's starting to look like it could be the one. I don't know how we're going to get through the mom fight, but the rest of the run's coming together pretty nicely. we got a whole, like, fly economy. If we could get, like, the item that doubles all of our fly damage somehow, I don't know how we're going to get that item, but if it could happen, we'd be pretty happy. Wait, what was that? Doubles our fly spawns? Continuum. Spectral tears travel through walls and appear out of the opposite wall. You never know. It could help. It could help. Doubles all blue fly and spider spawns. I actually think this might be about to go crazy. It actually went crazy. I'm loving my life right now. I am actually loving my life. This is amazing. We have so many little fly buddies. We're going to get hard carried by Rotten Baby. <laughs> I'm not even going to do the challenge. This is the Rotten Baby challenge. I'm having a wonderful time. Teleport me to the angel room. <gasps> Incredible. This is the, the Rotten Baby challenge. Let's go. If they scale with my damage, then I could not be happier right now. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my god. I mean, this run is in the bag. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh god, there's too many of them. That was a little stressful. It was a little stressful. I'm okay, though. 0.5 tears, 0.2 shot. I mean, this is just significantly better, huh? Hmm, what's in here? Oh, nothing. Um, we don't need to worry about blowing you up. I'm just gonna keep going. This is it. This is the one. This is the one they'll remember me for. They'll be like, this is the one. Remember that episode where he got like 30 minutes in and he was like, nah, I'm gonna keep going. I'm not done yet. That was crazy, man. And then he just fucking got that trapdoor. Oh my god, I couldn't believe it. He was like, I'm not stopping until I get the frickin' the rotten baby run. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'm still getting hit, but that's fine. Wait, we have golden bombs. Go back, take me back. Boom, boom, boom. I want blue hearts in this room. I'm going this way. I'm going this way, now I'm going this way. Who knows what's happening? Deadeye? This is an insane run? 
in the event that I fire a single shot at the boss, if I decide to then fire a second, it may well do 2,000 damage. Invincibility is fine. This is this is the big one. I can't like I don't have anything else to contribute besides my astonishment at how well this run has come out. I knew it could happen. I knew somewhere out there there was the perfect run where we would only get items that play into what we're trying to achieve here. Look at that. Look at the damage. Look at the size of the tear. How is it ever going to miss? Flight for the current room, I don't care. I like this a lot more. Ow, that's too many things for me to dodge. We do have golden bombs. Maybe I should be checking more of these skulls. Well, there you go. Exhibit A. I mean, more keys isn't going to do a lot for me, but... Oh my god, I'm loving my life right now. I'm loving my life. 50% chance for the double pickups. Uh, honestly, I don't care about any of this. I'm out of here. Wait. Oh, my golden bombs. The moon? I could not care less about. Let's keep going. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Incredible. I'm just endlessly stunned by how good it is. I keep expecting them to not do what I want them to do, but you know what the crazy thing is? They just keep doing it. It just keeps working, and I don't know why. I dare you to let me fire one more. Look at that. The damage was incredible. I mean, if there were ever a run to, to boss rush, it's not this one because all these items suck. So let's keep going. Down we go. I'm gonna say it. I'm ready to say it. I don't remember if I said it on the other ones, but I'm ready to say it now. And I, like, and mean it. This is actually the one. This is it. We're gonna be free at long last. We're gonna be free from Onan's streak. And everyone's gonna be like, it, amazing. Everyone's going to be like, I cannot believe it. Finally, we can play the Binding of Isaac again. Not quite. We do still have to do the Guardian, which if it's coming right after Onan's streak, you'd hope it's kind of like the nicest, easiest run in the entire game. Because this has been messed up. This feels like it should be the final one in the category. So I, I'm kind of terrified of what comes next. But maybe that's it. Maybe they want me to be afraid so that I'm pleasantly surprised. Maybe it's a little bit of that game of psychology coming into play. A little bit of uh, <laughs> UX for you. That's right, I know about UX. I googled it when someone said it in a meeting one time. Um, nervous, nervous, nervous. Get him, 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 I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared. Maybe I should have put a little more trust in my boys. I'm feeling like I maybe should have put a little more trust in my boys. Because it was only when I moved and didn't shoot that I, um, that I got hurt there. Okay, this is worrying. Grab that. Oh my god, I thought I was done for. That was huge. He could have gone for any of the tentacles, but he went for the eye. I'm not even going to open the dice room. We're not re-rolling this run. It's not happening. It's too perfect. You can try and convince me, but it's just not going to happen. There has never been a run this good. The, I mean, there has been a run this good, but there hasn't been an own end streak this good. Every other Onan streak run pales in comparison to this one. Look at that! Oh my god, I love my life! What's in here? Yo, oh, Trisation! And you gotta give me Squeezy, surely. 
You gotta give me the squeezy, and then we go down. I could not be happier. <laughs> I'm so pleased. Um... All right, if we, I, we've now, for this final, like, two floors, we can start to think about thinking about literally anything besides the run. We're now, like, in the relaxed zone. Um, What am I going to have for dinner tonight? Oh, my God, so many options. I've been eating a lot of chicken. Like, I would love to just eat some more chicken, but I've eaten so much chicken lately. I'm wondering if just, like, some pasta wouldn't do the trick. Like, just eat just a little bit of pasta, and that's it. And just don't... Don't fret about, you know, how intricate or complex it is. Just, like, some Alfredo sauce. Which, to my understanding, like, I was trying to... I was trying to do some, like, complex shit with my Alfredo. But I realize now you can maybe just, like, literally throw some butter and... Parmesan into a, a pot with some pasta and you're probably good to go. Crack some pepper on top and you're done. And I mean, this takes me back to the conversation from before, from the other week, about um, the buttered pasta. Like, who in their right mind? I got a lot of questions for my parents. I ate too m too many times did I eat just plain pasta with some grated cheese on it. Honestly, like ch you just grate some cheddar on that? Are you kidding me? Even grating it into like the smaller pieces, like into the cons like the the not the consistency, but the fineness of of um of grated parmesan, where you like grate it super fine. Doing that with cheddar, I feel like even then you're improving the meltability. And as a result, imp Whoa! <laughs> what just happened to that man? Or that baby? Holy, Isaac has absolutely no idea what's coming for him. He has no idea. We'll keep Dead Cat on hand in case of emergency. Oh my god, he has no idea what's coming. <laughs> he doesn't know. Why do I keep taking damage? Oh my god. It counts as a miss? Oh my fucking god, I just died. Oh my fucking god.